again tonight. Kopitar's goal in overtime propelled them to a win the last time they faced off. Michael's physicality forced a number of turnovers the last time he played them. It's the Ducks and the Kings, the Battle of SoCal next. Opening face-off just moments away. The Ducks start things off on the right note by winning the opening draw. Now a quick pass to Johns. Oh, Smart has that play to put that one away. Quick feed to Everard. Shuts it down with the paddle with a stop. As a goal player, you have to be able to read and anticipate the play. He does it perfectly and is able to negate the shot. We're still in the early stages of this period. We're still scoreless. The Kings win the defensive zone faceoff. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Puck dumped in. Anaheim's gained possession along the boards. Right up Main Street under the attack. Puck picked up by Doughty. And he slides it quickly to Kopitar. And he slides it quickly to Fiala. Oh, what a smart heads-up play. And now he moves it quickly to Johns. Steps across the blue line. Quick pass to Anderson. Great pressure with the stick. And he avoids the poor check with some great edge work. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. Gets the puck over to Anderson. Takes the feet at the back end. And that caroms off a of potty in the lane. Puck scooped up by Silverberg. And it's a quick pass to Richards. Oh, great move to shake off the check. Battle along the boards. LA's got a hold of it against the wall. Now a quick pass to Janot. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Moore. Great heads up play in the neutral zone by Tibble. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. Here's a short pass to Deneau. Shot! Shuts him down. Anaheim's got the puck. Chris made an incredible save right there, and it's kind of status quo. He's had such a consistent presence in the net all season long, as indicated by his save percentage. His team's in the win column. Can't do much more than give your team a chance. After that huge hit, he's really laboring to get off the ice. And you know that no player ever wants to stay down. So he's finding a way, mustering up everything he's got in him to find his way to the bench. Moves it quickly over to Brink. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Anaheim's on the attack. Moves it to Edmondson. And sends it just out of reach. And somehow he hangs on. The Kings gain possession along the wall. Los Angeles moves ahead with the puck. And he's knocked off the puck there. Handles the puck. Good fight for the puck along the boards. LA's got the puck along the wall. Anaheim's looking to break out of their own end. Puts it in deep. Los Angeles has possession of the puck. Feeds it on over to Edmondson. Some great thievery in the open ice. And he sidesteps the check there. Takes the puck along the boards. With possession along the wall. Dishes it off. Sends the feed in front. And that's stopped. And he slides it quickly to Jones. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. The Ducks will play it in their own end. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. With some open space at center. Gets the puck in deep. Los Angeles gains a hold of the puck against the boards. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. Moves it to the middle. Great defensive hits up play to pick it off. And he slides it quickly to Johns. Take it along the wall by Power. Oh, that's a good hit. Gains the zone from the right side. Here's a chance. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? LA's got the puck behind the net. 
Silverberg's moving it ahead. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Into the offensive end now. Quick shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Quick feed to Dowdy. The Ducks take over on possession. There's an injection of energy with that hit. Makes the save with the Trapper. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. Let's have another look at that hit there, James. I mean, he looks shaken up. that just continually perform in those big games, Cheryl. Well, yeah, when the pressure is on, they deliver. I mean, just look at the stat sheet. He is a point-per-game player against this rival opponent, James, and you know that there's a level of urgency to his game. He brings everyone around him, and they rally towards the fight. A little bump and grind, but still hangs on to the puck. And now he moves it quickly to Brink. Los Angeles looks to get things going now with the puck. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Gaining momentum along the wing. Sends it in deep. The Ducks will play the puck from behind the net. Inside the final minute of the first here. Sent into the offensive zone. The Kings have it now. Los Angeles has a chance for one last rush before time runs out of the period. Looking for space inside the D zone. Passes over to Edmondson. Can't pull the trigger. Here's a shot. Hucks in the net, but the whistle sounds blowing the play again. Both teams getting a good sweat on after this first period. We've got lots more in store, and we're coming back with a clean sheet of ice cream. Your team's proud exclusive banking partner. Fans back in their seats. Teams are on the ice. They're ready to drop the puck here for period number two. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. And it's a quick pass to Anderson. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. The Ducks gain control of the puck against the wall. Big time stop there. Well, fortunate for him that these masks are made so well nowadays because he just got his bell rung. Kemper's going to hang on for a whistle. Lots of time left in this period. one nothing is where we sit at this point. Kopitar's won the faceoff. The Kings move the puck in the defensive zone. And now he tries to get it across to Fiala. Anaheim's got the puck along the boards. Michael's picking up steam. Scrum along the boards. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. Shot! He's in! He scores! Whoa! Well, the ultimate power forward move here, James. When you decide you're going to attack the net, you're going to compete, and you're going to utilize your will to drive the dot. Just love the shield and love the finish on this play. Molly better get out of the way because the big rig, he decided to drive the net. And that'd be pretty intimidating, James, when you know that he's going to step in with his shoulder to shield the puck 
and find a way to get to the back of the net. Uh, defenders, I'd be stepping out of the way. Anaheim's really changed the complexion of this game. Look at this. We're all evened up here in period number two, Sheriff. Yeah, and to do it at the beginning of the second is key. You really want to dictate pace and send a direct message to your opponent, and they do that with that goal. Here's a short pass to Richards. And Ross got it in the defensive zone. And that pass is redirected. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. And that's knocked away by Tippett. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Jostling for the puck, but still maintains possession. Moves it quickly over to Byfield. Through the neutral zone, up along the wing. Moves it to the middle! And he denies that great opportunity there. And that's taken away in the offensive end by Silverberg. Back at the point, they set it up. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Feeds it over! Big time blocker stopped by Kemper. Poked away in the neutral zone by Jolene. Through pass ahead. Great use of the stick at center by Silverberg. Anaheim's through center and now in the offensive end. Takes the puck. And he comes up with the glove save. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Nearing the midway mark of the period. We are all tied up in this one. LA's won the defensive zone draw. Moves it to the Fourier. Poked away at center by Niskanen. Darlene's loving the puck. Some solid defensive work in the road end with the poke check. Right up the gut, here they go. And he totally whiffs on that one. Locks it into the offensive zone. Los Angeles has it in the defensive end. The Ducks gain control of the puck. Picked off by Anderson. The Kings cross the blue line and are on the attack. Anderson's tripped up and the official's hand is in the air, signaling penalty. Darlene's getting called for tripping. Rossi's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Kings have it now. Sends the cross ice pass. Broken up by Rossi. Centering feed. Another pass. Dishes it off again here. Another pass. And another pass. Moves it again. Comes up with a stop. Oh, 
Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. Champions quick stick off the draw wins possession. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. Now a quick pass to Dowdy. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Kopitar's got it to the side. Gets a piece of it with the glove. Save made by the goalie. the midway mark in this period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Dalene's almost back on the ice. Anaheim's time in the box is up, and we are back to even strength and still tied up here. Specialty teams are so huge in any game, James, especially when it's tied. You don't want to fall behind and have discipline really be a factor in the game. Here we go. Pucks in deep. And he slides it quickly to Champion. Read that perfectly with the poke check. And he slides it quickly to Kopitar. Sent in deep and the forwards will go to the bench. Loses his balance on the play. Handles the pass. Gets it over to Johns. Slides it across. Oh, James, uh, not much room available, but that one, perfectly executed. Anytime you're in the grade A scoring chances and your funnel tight to the net, you want to make sure you get a quick release shot off. There's coverage there. It's all about accuracy at that point, and he doesn't miss. The Ducks have gone in front by one here in the second period. Yeah, and it certainly changes the mindset when you're ahead by one in a very close deadlock game, James. Now they got to push the pace, put the pedal to the metal, and try and figure out a way to cash in again. Puck grab by Niskanen. The Ducks play the left wing. Oh, just a great heads-up play by Edmondson. Huge hit in the corner. And now he moves it quickly to Edmondson. L.A.'s got it along the wall. Goaltender gave him nothing as it goes off the side of the net. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. L.A.'s looking to break out. He looks deep to Fogel. Fires it on net. Anaheim's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Fogel's really impressed me with that last play, James. I mean, to have the wherewithal to hold on to that puck, I mean, that's tenacity on your way down, falling to the ice and still get the shot off. That's leadership at its best. Maintains control of the puck. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. And a smart heads-up read to come up with the puck. Rocked him in the open ice. The Ducks have it from their own end. Quick feed to Richards. Anaheim's got the puck against the boards. Passes it over. There's a stop with the blocker by Kemper. And he takes the pass. Anaheim's got it in the neutral zone. Slides it diagonally to tip it. And that's a great heads up play by Deneau. And he coughs it up with the pass. Dishes it off. Knocked away. Oh, and the puck clears the zone. They'll be forced to do this one over. Big time save on a big time shot. And the puck's knocked loose. The Ducks gain possession along the wall. Working the puck deep inside their own end. You know, it's not going to be able to get away from the booze and the chance every time he touches the puck, all because of that play earlier where he hurt their player. He'll keep it alive and moves it ahead. Tries to get the puck to Rossi. Puts it on net. Oh, at the buzzer, a big save. Well, this has become the hottest ticket in town. Literally another sellout. What can you say? This is an ongoing theme now, Cheryl. It's an ongoing theme because they're on a roll when you're playing well, and it's a lot of fun to watch. People want to be in the building to see your next W.
Welcome back, everybody. You know you weren't going to miss this third period. Sabalski, Pounder, ready to bring you the action. Here we go. Period number three is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, two periods down. Here we go with the third period. Cheryl, your assessment so far. Los Angeles is behind in this third period, James, but it's a close game, so I expect a full court press. Everyone punching towards the puck, everyone pushing north and trying to attack. They need to score. They got to get goals, and the time is now. Here's a shot. Makes a save, but barely with that one. Dumps it in. The Ducks gain possession. Oh, what a hit along the wall. And that's a clean one, James. A great angle, shoulder to shoulder, and just laid it on thick. tonight, and they lead it early in this third period. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. Answered the call there. Kemper's got the puck, and we'll get a stoppage in play. Well, and this is a huge play right here, just recognizing the tempo of the game and being able to dictate it. He's done it all night. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Ducks lead it 2-1 in what has been an entertaining game thus far. With the blast, makes the save. Anderson's moving the puck through his own zone. Solid check to slow him down. The Ducks take it along the wall. Intercepted at center by Moore. Huge steal at his own end. Tippett's got it in the defensive end. Quick pass to Darlene. Moves the puck. Dished on over to Silverberg. Fires it. That's off a stick. Takes the feed at the point. Feeds it over. Here's a short pass to Tippett. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Moves it quickly over to Moore. And forces a huge turnover here with the steal. Moves it to Power. Picked up along the wall by Tippett. He carries the puck up along the wing. Makes a save. Puck is frozen and we'll get a face off. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. The Ducks are clinging to a 2-1 lead. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Stop that one. Anaheim's got a hold of the puck now. Moves it out over to Foley. Delayed penalty looming. The goaltender is quickly off to his bench to get the extra attacker out. There's the whistle, and here's the call. And coach is looking for an explanation here from the official. Yeah, I mean, he's getting the refs here because he wants to know why his team is being penalized more often, and it's clearly having a factor in the game. toward the bottom of the league here, and they couldn't get things going the first time around on the ice tonight. So power play number two coming up right now. Hopefully they can get something going here and move in the right direction. Oh, your stick denies them in front. Let's get the call. Well, when you're looking for the equalizer, it's tough to take a penalty and play shorthanded, James. You got to find a way to get to even strength so you can generate some offense. A little more room out there with a little four-on-four. Four. Well, four-on-four four is similar to three-on-three. Three. There's more ice available, and you can't just dump it in. You want to possess the puck and try and create numbers around the ice. That's two-on-ones all over. Fialos across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. Slides the puck across. Anaheim's got it in their own zone. Oh, those boards rattled after that hit. Wow. And he's rattling as well, James. I mean, we knew that hit was coming, and then all of a sudden, bell, and he's down for the count. And some textbook body contact there. Headman pass. 
Anaheim's got a small window to go to work here on this power play with the penalty expired. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Anaheim's got it in their own zone. Takes a shot. Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. Uh, he's dialed in tonight, James. When the puck is on his stick, he is a magician. He goes east-west, he can go north-south, and most importantly, he creates his own space. He does take it to the net, but this time the goaltender makes the save. Picked up along the boards by Fiala. Oh, and he gets a piece of the puck to deny them there. The Ducks take it along the wing. Quick feed to Johns. And that shot dies in traffic. And now it's grabbed by Edmondson. And a smart heads up play to put that away by Tippett. Along the half wall with the puck. Denies him, he got all of it. Quick pass to Cheneau. Pass back to the point. Oh, he stops him with the glove. Great reflexes there. Ottawa's coming up next on the schedule. And these two teams, doesn't matter where they are in the schedule, where they are in the standings, always a good contest. I'm looking forward to that one. Anaheim's got a hold of the puck. Battle along the wall. Here's a short pass to Lewis. Wow. And they score! And here we go with a clutch third period goal to even things up. Well, it's outstanding to stay in this game, James. I mean, it's all the ups and downs and weathering the storm. They've done everything in this one and they find themselves clawing their way back to evens. Well, this D-zone turnover certainly caught the goaltender off guard, James, and he was unable to get set to position. And when this happens, often one area of the net is exposed. This time it's down low and a goal ensues. LA's picking the plot here in this third period by tying it up. I always find it so interesting, James, and how the game shifts throughout it. And at the end of the game, finally, there's a sense of urgency. And because of it, they're able to capitalize on the scoring chance. Takes a hit, but still hangs on to the puck. Moves it quickly over to Johns. And that's a smart heads up play by Fogel. This is the best part of the game. It's really tight. It's down the stretch. One mistake either way will be the difference maker. Anaheim's got possession here in the offensive zone. Los Angeles gets the puck near the boards. Quick pass to Fogel. And now he moves it to the Fourier. Avoids the poke kick. How many bodies in the way? Slides the pass over to Niskanen. Takes the feed from the left side. Back to the blue line. Oh, that's a smart heads up play as he breaks it up with the poke. Centering feed. And he shuts down so impressive in particular in that last sequence James and he is out and yes it didn't prevent him from making that save but now he's going to get some much needed rest as that puck heads out of his zone and he sprints to the bench to get the extra attacker out on the ice off the mask of the goaltender boy right between the eyes there's the whistle let's see what the referee saw Late in the third tied game, and the coach is letting the official know. Listen, put the whistle away, and the official saying, uh-uh, the rules are the rules. <laughs> LA's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. They haven't scored on their power play yet. They've earned this opportunity. They'll get another look at it, look for different adjustments to be made. Kopitar's won the draw, and they're on the attack. Takes the feed. Scores! So it's a power play goal, and it puts them in front. Well, that's perfect execution. You have that player advantage. You gotta use it. They did it. Now they're ahead. I love that he fights to get tight to the net here, and it's all about accuracy and a quick release. It's not about how hard it is, and he doesn't miss. Often as an athlete, you're trying to read your coach and the temperature of them throughout the game. And right now, you can get a great read on the bench boss because he is just covered with emotion. It's in his body language. It's in his speech, the way he's talking to the athletes as they got the go-ahead goal. 
Anaheim's been very active offensively tonight, but they just have not been able to finish on their scoring chances here late in the third. From the neutral zone now. LA's got the puck in their own end. That's taken away. Great defensive effort there. And he serves it across to Faber. And that's intercepted by Spence. Levels him with the hit. Great four check by Kopitar. The Ducks will play it from the defensive zone. Anaheim's going on the attack as they gain the zone. What a save! Crystal! to try and win it all. Anaheim's regained possession of the puck. And we are still tied as we approach the final minute of the third. Slides the puck over to Byfield. The Kings played along the boards. And it's a quick pass to Deneau. Shot makes the save. Shot redirected. And that goes off the player in front. In the final moments of this period, we got a tie game. The Ducks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Faber stick handling in his own zone. Moves it to Richards. There's a solid collision. Los Angeles jumps into the offensive end and goes on the attack. Slides the puck over. Critical draw here. The Ducks take possession off the faceoff. Great reach by Jones. And he takes the feed. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Edmondson. Dumps it in. Anaheim's got the puck along the boards. There's the horn. Neither team giving an inch to each other tonight, and so we'll go to overtime next. Overtime. Moments away. Social media is buzzing with who's going to be the OT hero. It is underway. This has really become one of the real 
premier party destinations in the hockey landscape, and here's a reason why. Look at this celebration here, Cheryl. And you gotta love this. I mean, the fans are there for you while you're playing the game, and you come back out to say thank you to them. Well, we certainly had a great time tonight. Everybody in the broadcast crew as well, and from all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Sabalski wishing you a safe and a healthy night, and we'll see you down the road again soon.